How to fix update stuck on initializing error in Destiny 2 Warmind. 1. Run the Blizzard app with the Run as Administrator option. Please refer to the below image. Hint 1, you'd be able to locate that option on the context menu. 2. Delete these Blizzard app files from percent program data percent and C colon backslash program data backslash. Hint 2, if you can't delete those files, try the following two sub steps. Step 1, deleting the battle.net. Cache folder. Close open Blizzard programs. Press Ctrl plus Shift plus ESC to open the task manager. Click the processes tab. If agent.exe is running or Blizzard update agent in Windows 10 select it and click end process. Refer to the below IMG. Press Windows key and R to open the run dialog. Type percent program data percent into the run field and press enter. If a Blizzard entertainment folder exists in the directory, refer to the below IMG, right click it and select delete. Step 2, deleting battle.net files. Press Ctrl plus Shift plus ESC to bring up the task manager. Click the processes tab. Select all agent, Blizzard Battle.net desktop app, and game processes, and click end process. Press Windows key and R to open the run dialog. Type C colon backslash program data backslash into the open field and press enter. Delete the Battle.net folder. 3. Run the computer in a selective startup mode, clean boot, and find out the program that stopped your Destiny 2 warm wind from running properly. Then, you may temporarily disable that troublesome application from running with your computer. 4. Power cycle your network equipment like router. 5. Flush system DNS by running the commands as the admin user, IP protocol configuration slash release IP protocol configuration slash renew IP protocol configuration slash flush and 6. Run a full scan of the computer with the recommended Avast internet security, this helps detect and clear potential malware in your system. 7. Also, some security programs can cause this to occur. Temporarily disable any security program using the admin right. 8. Go to your task manager and end the battle.net. Update agent. Then rerun agent and try again. 